All right, what's up? Good morning, everybody. Today is Friday, March 31st. My name is Nathan Gray. We're live here in Tulsa, Oklahoma, and you're watching Three Points. First off, let's get right into it. Hey, a bit of good news. If they can do it, so can we. This morning in Seoul, South Korea, recently impeached President Park Geun-hye was arrested, jailed, and is awaiting trial. Yeah, A judge in the Seoul Central District Court issued a warrant early this morning. Her charges include bribery, extortion, and abuse of power. Last December, the National Assembly voted to impeach her, and by March 10th, she was out. This is how we can do it, Team America, because we got to get, we got a guy who's guilty of all the above. And moving right along, early this morning in the city of Parachinar in northwest Pakistan, a car bomb explosion at a mosque has killed at least 22 people and injured another 70. The car was left at the women's entrance of the mosque just as people were gathering for morning prayers. Parachinar is the capital of Quram, an area known for clashes between Sunni and Shia Muslim groups. And lastly, in local news, yesterday in Oklahoma City, the Oklahoma Bar Association launched an investigation into an ethics complaint filed against that sniveling bastard, Scott Pruitt. Pruitt is accused of using a personal email address for business as Attorney General of Oklahoma, but specifically emails between Pruitt and executives with the American Fuel and Petrochemical Manufacturers Association might show a bit of conflict of interest as he is the chief of the EPA. That about finishes off the gourd for today. I hope you all have a wonderful weekend. Until next time, you've been watching Three Points.